Sup toy fans, here for a very special episode of Bugsy's Toy Box, checking out the vintage toy monster oh, yeah. for the first time. That's Ben, that's Muggsy, and this is Bugsy's Toy Box. So we're here with the proprietor of this wonderful toy heaven, Mr. Ian himself. How are you doing, buddy? Yeah, great, thank you. Thank you very much for letting us come and have a wander around for anybody yeah, else. No, yeah, you're welcome, you're welcome. Pristine, absolutely pristine. There's some beautiful things in this shop. I'd say, like, how long have you been collecting? Well, I started in uh, 1990. Yeah? In the recession of 1990, just as sort of like, something to do really. Get me, get me, out, of the, get me out of the house on a Sunday morning. Yeah, yeah. Going around car boot sales and it stemmed on to toy fairs. Yeah, so, perfect. Yeah. So you like you do the toy fairs and stuff as well, yeah? Yeah, I used to go to the toy fairs, uh, you know, looking for better stuff. You know, you go to the car boot to find sort of lower end stuff, and uh, go to the toy fairs for the higher end stuff. So it was a bit of a, an addiction. Oh, it's obviously like snowballed throughout the years. Yeah, as like indeed. Now in... Yeah, this is years of hoarding, years yeah. of hoarding, and yeah. it's uh, yeah, it's, it's the way it's gone. When when did you decide that you know what I've got enough stuff? I I want to open a bricks and mortar shop. Do you know what I've always wanted to have my own shop? But I've never been in a position uh, to have it, um, and then obviously the the, the, uh, the opportunity turned up, and uh, I just grabbed it by the horns and thought, right, I've got to go for it. Amazing. Yeah, I know. Absolutely amazing. Know. Well, it's obviously a labour of love. You can tell just it's, by walking through it. It has taken us literally months to uh, to put everything on the shelves. It has taken so long. I didn't think expected it to take me this long. But <laughs> we've got there in the end. All the individual little price tags and bits and pieces. Yeah, definitely. I'll tell you, you've yeah. got some beautiful stuff in there. I mean, stuff that you just don't see. Even like American exclusives. Yeah. I mean, everything's in here. I mean, there's literally everything in here, guys. I mean, you've, you've got Star Wars. You've got Brave Star. You've got like X-Men and all the Marvel characters, you've got uh, He-Man and Thundercats, you've got just anything you think of, Gremlins, like you've even got some of the newer stuff that you can see behind us, it's such a plethora. I mean, you've got Last 17 in there that are like mint in box. Yeah. yeah you've got original um, mangoes from the 70s, like, right. and they are pristine. Yeah. Like carded visionaries and like all, you just, stuff you just do not see. Stuff you do not see. I mean, tell you, what's, your, what's one of your favourite bits in it? Um, I suppose one of my favourite bits I've picked up quite recently, and that's uh, Amigo Shazam. Which, I've never seen one in any of the fairs around here. Maybe they've been out there, I've never seen one, so I've, I snapped him up. That's uh, amazing. Yeah, I mean, he, you know, it's a great item, which you just don't find. But that's he's in the shop, he's in the shop. Regrettably, you're not going to sell it, so... Oh, well, it's going to go to a good home at some point. Hopefully, yes. yes. Well, there you go. You heard it here first. There's some bits in here that you may not have ever seen in your life. I know that there's some bits that I've never seen in my life. We're going to have a carry-on wander around. <laughs> Thank you. 
so much. Yeah, no problem. Thanks Last, for coming. Lastly, just tell the guys, when are your opening hours? Uh, Thursdays, Fridays and Saturdays, I think it's 10 to 5.30 uh, each day. Uh, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesdays and Sundays closed. Perfect. Well, there you go. In the, in the sunny seaside town of Portsmouth, come on down. Honestly, you will not believe it's your eyes. It's the place to be. It's the place to be. Absolutely, Ian. Thank you so yeah, much. Yeah, no worries. Thank Keep you. Keep tuned in, guys. We'll catch you in a bit.